Hey there, folks. Welcome back to the For Real channel. I'm Anna, and today we've got a super helpful guide for all you Apple Watch users out there. We're going to walk you through the process of unpairing your Apple Watch from your iPhone and restoring it from a backup. Whether you're upgrading to a new watch or dealing with some connectivity issues, we've got you covered. But before we dive in, do me a solid favor. If you find this video helpful at any point, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe to our channel, and drop a comment below with any questions or thoughts. It really helps us keep the content coming your way. All right, let's get started. So you've got tons of precious data, activity history, and personalized settings on your Apple Watch, right? Well, just like you back up your iPhone or iPad regularly, you should do the same for your watch. Here's how. 1. Open the Settings app on your iPhone. 2. Tap on your name at the top of the screen. 3. Scroll down and tap on iCloud. 4. Scroll down again and tap on iCloud Backup. 5. Make sure the toggle next to Backup This iPhone is on. 6. Then tap the Backup Now button at the bottom of the screen. Wait for the backup to finish. Now that your precious data is safely backed up, let's move on. Whether it's time to upgrade to a new Apple Watch or you're facing some pesky connectivity issues, unpairing your Apple Watch is the way to go. Here's the lowdown. 1. Launch the Apple Watch app on your iPhone. 2. In the bottom left corner, tap the My Watch tab. 3. In the top left corner, tap the All Watches button. 4. Tap the Info button next to your watch. 5. At the bottom of the screen, tap the Unpair Apple Watch button. 6. When prompted, enter your Apple ID password. 7. Finally, tap the Unpair button in the top right corner. Boom! Your Apple Watch is unpaired and ready for its next adventure. Now, let's bring back all your personalized settings and data onto your newly unpaired Apple Watch. Here's how to restore it from a backup. 1. Make sure your Apple Watch and iPhone are close to each other. 2. Open the Watch app on your iPhone. 3. In the bottom left corner, tap the My Watch tab. 4. Tap the Start Pairing button. 5. Tap the Set Up For Myself button. 6. When prompted, line up your iPhone's camera with the pattern that appears on your Apple Watch to begin the pairing process. 7. Now, tap the Restore From Backup button. 8. Select the most recent backup that you created. If you had issues before, choose the backup from before those problems started. 9. When prompted, tap the Continue button and follow the on-screen steps to complete the pairing process. Voila! Your Apple Watch is back to its familiar state and all your data is intact. Now, just in case you ever need to reset your Apple Watch without access to the paired phone or the watch's password, we've got you covered too. Here's what to do. 1. Charge your Apple Watch by placing it on its charger. It's crucial to keep it connected during the reset process. Two. Force restart the watch by simultaneously pressing and holding both the side button and the digital crown for at least 10 seconds. Release them when the Apple logo appears. 3. After the watch restarts, it should display an option to erase all content and settings. Confirm this choice to proceed with erasing all data from the Apple Watch. Remember, if activation lock is enabled, you'll need the original Apple ID and password to set up the watch with a new iPhone. And that's a wrap. You're now armed with the knowledge to unpair your Apple Watch, restore it from backup, and even reset it if needed. All right, folks, that's all for today's tutorial. I hope you found this video helpful, and if you did, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe to our channel, and leave a comment down below. Your support means the world to us. If you have any more tech topics you'd like us to cover, just drop them in the comments, and we'll get right on it. Thanks for tuning into 4Real, and I'll catch you in the next one. Take care.